Hey everyone, Tanya Fox here from Crafty Crafters. Yep, guess where I'm standing? New stuff in. So, we finally got the new decorative pillows in. So we have all four of the butterflies, the dragonfly, we've got the dancing fish, I call them koi fish, but um, there is also a, a turtle one, which I'm gonna show you in just a second. And for those of you that bought this as a picture, we also have the hot lips pillow. So it can actually match the diamond dots wall hanging um, one. Also, we got in um, their stickers here, all of the different stickers that you can do. So you can add them to your binders or even on the back of your cell phone to sparkle up one of your cases. And we also have the magnets as well. Um, so they're really fun kits. Again, come with everything that you need um, inside of them. And uh, you actually just do the diamond dots right on the magnets. So those are super fun. But there are some tips and tricks that I have learned with these new decorative pillows. So we're gonna show you now. All right, Lily, let's go show them the pillow, come on. So we're gonna head over here to my working counter by my cash. And I'm gonna show you just some of the tips and tricks that I've learned from doing the pillow and some of the mistakes that I've made that I don't want you to make. So here we have the awesome turtle pillow. So I'm actually making this for my mom because she's moving into a new place that has a beautiful sunroom and um, she used to live in Puerto Rico. And so I just thought that was bright and sunny and it just reminds me of the island. So, um, and who doesn't need a little bit of glitter in their life? So this is the pillow. Now I'm gonna show you the back of the pillow right now. Look at the beautiful fabric that they have on the back of their pillows. It's really nice, already comes all sewn. You just need to slip a pillow form in there and your pillow is ready to go. Now, while you're doing the diamond dots, I do suggest you move the zipper around. Um, I didn't on mine and I did find that the beads kind of slipped a little bit. So move that zipper as you're going. When you open it up, you'll notice that the plastic goes all the way across the top. And there is a little sticker, which you can see here, that says detach protective film from edge seam before dotting. So of course I stuck my finger in there and pulled it and now I'm taking tweezers. I don't know if you'll be able to see it because it's clear, but I'm having to take tweezers and kind of pull all of these little plastic pieces out because um, they're stuck in there. So I found a way to do it. So what you're gonna do is just take scissors and you're actually, you don't, even have to like cut once, the scissors will cut right through it. You're gonna just go like this across the seam. Yeah, I already pre-cut it, but, um, and just leave a little bit of film. So my design, because it's in the middle, I can leave quite a bit of film. This gives you enough area to hold on to, and you can actually just pull it out and it'll come out like perforated paper without leaving any mess on your pillow so you got one full piece and you don't have to keep picking stuff so that would be my suggestion cut around and pull gripping onto the seam and then you're ready to go your diamond dots work just the same as it does on all of your other projects i do find there's a little bit more glue on these ones which i think is a good thing i think the adhesion will be a lot better it being a pillow but let's be honest you're not really gonna lie on this pillow. You're gonna end up with half a turtle on the side of your face. So they really are more made to be decorative and to show off your diamond dots and look really cool on the couch. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel and comment below on which pillow is your favorite. Thanks for joining us and happy dotting.